What's going on, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another Beater Box Unboxing with Sailboat Sneakers. It's been a long ass time since I've been here. Had some shit going on, had to deal with it. You know, we just had to roll with it, but I am back. This is the first video back, and I am super, super pumped about just getting into the groove of things here. So I figured during the holiday season, it was only right to bring my cousin, Z-Man, onto the show. Unfortunately, this is definitely not a hype box by any stretch of the imagination. This is a donation box by another beater box member, j 4 Kicks. Check him out below. Great guy. And I'm just really, really pumped about the fact that we were able to work out a great deal on this box. Now this is a bunch of shoes from donation boxes. I have no idea what's in it. I don't know what to expect. He said that he threw some extra stuff in there. I guess we'll find out. All right. So. <laughs> yeah. So that's the first thing. <laughs> so first thing, yeah. I'm gonna let Z-Man pull this out here. What's good? I don't even, I, I like, I literally don't know what this is. I have, <laughs> I've, what it, I, I don't do know. you know? I've never seen that in my life. I've never seen this in my life. This is a <laughs> fingerling right here. Uh, this is friendship at your fingertips. <laughs> like, I'm down, I'm super down. I don't, I don't even know I'm gonna look up what this is and find out if there's any reason we're selling it, but I might just keep it. Yeah, man. Is it a little decoration? It's Mia! <laughs> Je m'appelle Mia. Is what it says on the back of the box there. Oh, like what? I more. don't... <laughs> three more you can collect. Finn. Oh, <laughs> oh Boris. Bella and oh, Sophie. Dude, there's so many of these things. You gotta get Boris. Oh, wow. There's a whole team. I might need to get the whole fingerlings team. <laughs> Friendship at your fingertips. Yeah. Fingerlings. Might be the best thing in the box. <laughs> <laughs> it might be, who knows? Vans. Got some vans on. I got my vans on, but they look like sneakers. They're definitely worn. You can tell by the heel there. Size eight. No box. Overall decent condition. I would definitely say that these are nice little waffle sole there. No. Oh, what do you think? What do you think, Z-Man? Uh, does anybody with size eight feet come <laughs> cop? <laughs> so a real quick size eight cop right there. Yeah, little casual wear. Yeah, these are the lacing job. Whoa. Oh, that's pretty clean. The lacing job is cool as hell. Whoever laced these, kudos. And see the lacing on my vans. Did it myself. Hey. <laughs> oh, there's the box. Oh, box right here. It comes with OG box. I, I will reassemble this. Boom. OG box, good condition. Just needs to be refolded by somebody lovely like myself. So what do we should go? Oh, that's a Supreme sticker. All right. A nice little goodie bag here. Got a whole bunch of. That's a Supreme bouncy ball. <laughs> yeah, man. There's a couple of them. Damn, okay. Got some some slaps. Supreme box logo. Supreme box logo bouncy balls. I don't I don't know if they've like, ever done anything but a box logo bouncy ball, but got two of the bouncy balls. These are actually bigger than I thought they were. I oh, thought they were little tiny things. Size, yeah, this yeah. is like the size of at least a half quarter. I like this sticker. Press. Oh, that press that is a uh, okay. This is one of the few things, I'll admit, I like this this Supreme sticker right here. It's one of the few Supreme items I'm down with. Oh, we got some more. Wow, Supreme there's a whole bunch of turtle. stickers. Uh, that's like a graffiti drawing design. Hell yeah. And another box logo. Whole bunch of slaps up in this bitch. What's good? So far, like I'm already juiced up on what I have so far. Yeah, this is, I'm, I'm stoked. Number one thing though, obviously, finger length. Oh, of finger course, length of is number one. Nope. Let's go with the the Adidas. These are supposed to go to Sebastian Telfair. Uh, <laughs> they're basketball. 
Sample room. 2004, 1201. Yeah. Sebastian Telfair, <laughs> old school basketball player. I hope you guys heard that in the background. Sebastian Telfair is an old school basketball player. Oh. These are interesting. You don't know Sebastian Telfair? Is that real? I don't watch Yo, football. this is like a serious come up for a... Oh my God. Man, I don't even know what this is, but take a look. This is a, a promo pair right here. And still got those development tags on. There's no insoles up in these. But this is oh, yeah. like a really, really cool thing to. I certainly like this side with the stripes and the logo, but not sure the inside is very plain. Yeah, the yeah. media. But man, this is like a. What size is it? Size 13. Oh. That's you, bro. Baby. That's you. <laughs> Special last Sebastian Telfair, PDX Basketball, Adidas Game Day Lightning. So maybe this is a Game Day Lightning. But it's back from 2004, so like wearing these would probably be against my best judgment. However, some sort of player exclusive. Game time only, it says on the bar. Boom. I, that's a really cool pickup right there. Yeah, yeah, I've never seen that before. Man, so J4, J4 is hooking this box yeah. up. 12 and a half, rare size. Air bursts. These look to be a little bit <laughs> older though yeah. definitely some Seems signs like of bubble. age air bubble very very worn well not worn actually these look almost dead stock they but really do the air bubble is just a little super foggy yeah. actually i think that's on the outside you can get it off yeah. oh you can kind of rub it off a little bit I don't see a singer. I, think, I think these are like yeah. vintage dead stock, yeah. It's pretty crazy, crazy condition. And these are from 01. Oh, yeah. These shoes are That's damn near 20 years old. That's crazy. And it doesn't look like they've been worn for, like, this is. Those will probably sell for a pretty decent amount. It'll take a minute to find a buyer on these, but there's a market for this. Especially in very, very unworn condition. For this age, 20 years old, not bad. Overall, crushing this yeah, box. 100%. Crushing this box. Love it. Was it? Air slider. Ho ho! And pair of cleats. Base, uh, very baseball cleats, huh? I guess so. I would imagine so. I don't see what else you would use these cleats for. Um, yeah, definitely that. doesn't seem like a football cleat to me. Nope. But why'd you have a lace shield for uh, <laughs> for baseball? At any rate, kind of a weird looking shoe, or it's even a weirder looking cleat, quite honestly. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> this is like a very, very strange, strange cleat to me. I don't get it. It's old. It doesn't look like it's ever been worn. I'm going to say that these are dead stock too. Yes, yeah, certainly. Man, six sixty-five dollars. This was retailing for, and I don't see a tag. Oh, here we go. Ninety-nine. These are twenty years old. These wow. are twenty-year-old dead stock cleats. I don't know what the market is on that. <laughs> I, I don't know if there is a market on that. I've never seen somebody with cleats like these. So you could stand out. You yeah, could really yeah, stand yeah. out. Only one on your team. Size 11 and a half. Nobody. I'll tell you this much. If you buy these, ain't nobody gonna have these. <laughs> <laughs> Only one I can see. No one will have these. There's still a lot of shoes in here. Yeah. Oh. Hey. Slides. Soul Supremacy Slides. Size 46. Which I think is a men's 11-ish, maybe. Ever been worn? Brand new in package. I'm yeah. probably the first one that's taken out of this package. I, I'm gonna call it four and a half pairs of shoes, a pair of slides. Yeah. A finger laying. Oh no, oh. we got, oh there's, plus the van. There's a lot of shit in this box, man. Holy motherfucker, he's just lot floated stuff to me. Size 12 and a half. <laughs> 12 and a half. A super zoom. A super BBX. zoom BBX. Super zoom BBX. 
Yeah, my school's colors are, we usually have less white. This is a uh, old shoe. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Is this? That's aged. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it doesn't say how old look it at is. Look at the bottom. That's how old it is. Look at the bottom, like, look at yours. Oh, the whole thing, just at the top is fucking yellow. Oh, yeah. Yellow it out. Lots of oxidation on wow. these motherfuckers. Very old. But you know what? They're still in fucking crazy good they condition. They really are. Like the yellowing is is very evident, and that's oh, okay. there's no way around that because of how old they are. But I'm I'm pretty sure these are dead stocks. Yeah. Though. Like dead these. Stocks using these so far. Yeah. This. Oh, there's brown. Yeah, we got a stain on this one too. So we got staining. You just tell. I would fuck with these Nike. <laughs> I would fuck with this. <laughs> Put a react sole on this. A react, how about this? Make this into a react 270. Ooh. That upper on a 270 react would be that would, fire. Yeah, that would, that'd be pretty nice. That'd be fire, that'd be man. Pretty. Look at me, I'm, I'm writing up ideas for you right now. I should put a patent on that shit so you can't take it from me. Watch, three months from now, I'm gonna blow up and that's gonna be famous. Next up, another stupidly old box. Air Max CBBG White Black Dark Concord 5 U. Holy shit. That's... I'm like afraid to hold these. This is one of those shoes that I'm almost afraid to send out. Needless to say, this this kind of sneaker, uh, this old or this kind of bubble wear worries me. This is another one where it's so old that the date actually isn't on the tongue. Uh, or the label on the top, which is crazy, but it's withstood the test of time. Like there's really not a lot of wear on the uppers. Not at all. And the, the air bubble is clearly in <laughs> awful condition, but the rest of the shoe for being as old as it is, this thing has got to be at least 20 years old. Because we've already seen a, we've seen a pair from 99. Yeah, and that was And that was dated, but this pair right here is undated just like the pair before and still in crazy good condition. We still got five pairs to go through here. This is, this is awesome. Air Raid LE GS in a five youth. A gold lace and a black lace. And these are also in good condition. These are from 2007. We finally have a date on the top. So still, Relatively old, oh, yeah. as far as sneakers are concerned, but also in pretty solid condition overall. I like air raids. I like shoes with straps across the front. I'm a sucker for that. Yeah. I mean, I like the straps on the eights. Yup. Eights are my favorite same. Jordans. Eights the same. Yeah. It's uh yeah. See, cousins think alike. Yeah. Three. Also, great minds think alike. Three peats certainly best color. Which sides a dorm backers. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> my yeah. my personal favorite. Two different color laces. I wonder why that is. Though. That's a got a size 13. Air flight 89s. Air flight 89s. The way that we're going, this could potentially be an OG pair from me. Yeah, honestly, I don't do. Oh, These are in really good condition too. Man, everything in this box has been like. It's just the air. Everything in <laughs> It's just the air bubble again. It's clouded up. Yep. Yeah. Super cloudy air bubble. It looks pretty good though. There's like a little bit of creasing that can be seen on the front. Yeah. Minimal to no start loss or heel drag. Again, might as well be dead stock. It's just old. It's old as a motherfucker. Yeah, certainly. Yo, these are from 99. So this is another pair of shoes from 99. Again, another pair of 20 year old shoes. So a lot of vintage shoes that are in really, really good condition for their age, but just because of their age, might be dangerous to do anything except for half. Another old pair, size 12 and a half, air too strong, mid. Ooh, wow, interesting colorway. These are fragile. Definite. These cannot be worn. These have cracking on the midsole. You can oh, already see it. Wow. These things might blow up in the mail, quite honestly. Don't press the bottom bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Don't press it. I that button that that little, little bubble. Noise. Yeah, yeah, this that is bubble's not very strong. We're we're in really old territory here. 
more like a kind of put it up on a shelf as a trophy shoe. So the Air 2 Strong Force is a trophy ship. This is yeah. a holy grail to many, many people. <laughs> We're not going to wear these, right? Repeat after me if you buy these. I'm not going to wear these because they're going to fall the fuck apart. They've fallen more apart since I've been holding them. Yeah, I pressed the bubble and made a cracking noise, so... So, not gonna do that anymore. so don't wear these <laughs> unless you're gonna do something with the upper and change the bottom. Do not wear these. I want to play tennis in these. <laughs> Why? <laughs> I don't know, man. Not like this, like this style shoe. Not this specific one. I want to break my ankle. But like, I feel like this is a good tennis shoe. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I've never played tennis yeah, before, same. but I just like, I don't know, man. I just feel like it might be. Two more pairs, getting to the end of it here. Exciting Thank stuff, people. Ooh, size 12, ooh, these Air could Max be incredible. S. Air Max 97s. Can't say, colorway's my favorite. Laceless. No, no laces oh. either. Laceless. This <laughs> is certainly a different, uh, different Air Max 97 than what I've seen. This is, uh, oh. I feel like I'm watching a movie depicting the the 2020s that was made in 28 or, or 1980. Once again, don't press the bolt because it's kind of pushing at the seams when you do it. Yeah. yeah. Don't wear these. <laughs> um, again, repeat after me. I will not purchase these from sale by sneakers <laughs> and wear these. No, certainly not. I will do something other than wear them unless I'm planning on destroying the fuck out of them. I, oh, oh! There's different units on the heel. Oh. As far as how much the airbags are filled up, which is beyond my comprehension. How they are designating those individual pockets of air. Yeah, there might be some like even rusting or copper discolor. Who knows? At the bottom of the shoe, right there on the heel on the air unit there. Um, these are from 01. Wow. Yeah. This is an old box. Yeah, this has got a lot of retro oh, stuff in it. Last box. Box of Jordans coming up. Z-Man, it's all you. Enjoy. Right. Air Jordan 3 retro. Infrareds? Potentially, maybe. Hey, wow. Okay, now nah, these, right. so these are the infrareds. Not very old, but they are very worn. So these are from... Jordan tag in there. Oh damn, OG all. Laces. <laughs> Laces, they're on lace right now. Oh. You can see there's a lot of yellowing from age. Got some receipts. Some scuffing, some wear. We got some insoles. We got some, some OG insoles. Right about here with things stuck to them. <laughs> you got some replacement insoles in the shoe, so two for one deal, insoles. All right. Bought in 2014. 2014. But there's, I think they're a little older than that. <laughs> they're from 2013, late 2013. So if they were bought in 2014, it's not too surprising. You can see a ton of yellowing so on the toe box the there. Robert, Robert the cashier. Robert the cashier. <laughs> Thank you, Robert. <laughs> What's up, riggedy Robert? Oh, wow. Hey, Jordan Three has a box like this yeah, though. Certainly. J4 kicks, hooking it up. Some scuff in and everything, but this yeah. is a great restoration pair. This would be really, Seriously. really cool to see somebody take yeah. them and like see what they can do with them. Not bad though. Very well worth it. This is a dope box yeah. for the the price that was paid. This was phenomenal. Quite honestly, certainly haven't seen stuff that much age before. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, a lot of this stuff's older than you, man. <laughs> kind of crazy to think yeah. about that. Like these shoes are holding up pretty good, man. Some of them are dead stock. Are you still dead stock? <laughs> no, nope. he's not even dead stock. <laughs> <laughs> At any rate, guys, really appreciate y'all checking in. Uh, I'm glad to be back. Z man, what'd you think? It's pretty time? cool. Yeah, I love this. Perfect. Because <laughs> also website on the way, oh, if not man. already unveiled right now. So oh, take a look. Sneakers.com. So what sneakers.com? Oh, yeah. Crazy, crazy <laughs> to think that that's a real thing. That that'll be at the bottom. So. Appreciate you guys checking in, and uh, this is your boys, Sailboat and Zima. Yeah. Checking out.